Hello, welcome to January 7th DVD update. Yeah, um, I got a lot to show you, but before I get started, I would like to say I saw 2012 in theaters and it was alright. I also watched Sherlock Holmes and I liked it. Just to say, just to say, you know, because you know I'm always big on those reviews, but for some reason I don't feel like doing them. So I, I just told you now, you know, it doesn't really matter. Um, the first DVD I got was Matilda. And I like this movie a lot. I mean, I've talked about it before, I'm sure. Um, here's the bootleg or whatever, the stupid copy I have. You know, just like that. And it's got no binding. That's why I got the official release of it for $5.00. Doesn't really, I know, it's not a big deal, but. Next one I got was The Pest with John Leguizamo. Yeah, I believe that's how you say it. Um, this is kind of like a deliverance type movie. Uh, um, excuse me. Uh, he basically lets someone hunt him for $50,000. I really like this movie. I think it's very funny. Dang. And... I say you should check that out, though. That's a good one. Next one, I got this for Christmas. Hancock. I don't... It's alright. It's fine. It's it's actually pretty good, I guess, but... I'm not big on Will Smith films. I don't know. I, I'd much rather watch something else, to tell you the truth. I liked, like, Men in Black and stuff and all those, but... I don't know. Next one, I got this for Christmas. Blank Man. This is the one where his mom gets killed in this shootout, and he wants to become a superhero after that. Um, very funny. I liked it. Um, next one, uh, I got this for $3 at uh, Ollie's. Ollie's Outlet. Um, barber Shop. I had the second one, so I was like, I'll get the first one. It's basically about this life, like one day at a barber shop. Yeah, you're probably thinking, why are you rushing? Well, there's a lot of DVDs, that's why. I'm a little crazy. When it comes to DVDs, I'm just kind of like, that's how, that's what, when I see something I want, I get it. I mean, but yeah, barber shop's good. Next one. I got is Magic in the Water. Check this one out. I, I always love this film. Uh, I don't know why Siskel and Ebert trashed it, but it's really it's really heartfelt. I mean, I I really like that one. Next one, I got is Stephen King's The Shining. Now, this absolutely sucks compared to um, uh, Stanley Kubrick's one. Uh, his, this doesn't even come close. I mean, this sucks compared to that. But, the only reason I got it is because I wanted to see it. It was only $5. I wanted to re-see it because I saw it years ago. I mean, I mean, c come on. Stephen King, just admit it. The Shining, the original 1981, The Shining, was spectacular. I don't know why he doesn't admit it. Because he wrote the book and all that, and he was disappointed because he was trying to make a point on alcohol or something. Next one I got is Eight Heads in a Duffel Bag. This is one where he switches um, bags with this other guy, and he has eight heads in it. And he has to try and get the bag back. Very funny. Really like that. Next one, Osmosis Jones. Check this one out. This one's... Very clever, very funny, and you might learn a bit of, of something. You know, you might, you might, you might learn. You might, you might learn. You might learn some stuff. You know, you might learn some stuff. By the way, this is um, HD camera, so you might see you might see some acne and a booger, and you might see some earwax. You know, you'll just get some more features. Um, next one I got: <laughs> uh, Lost Stallions, The Journey Home. 
I don't know why I was tempted to get this, but it had Mickey Rooney in it, and I was just like, I'll get it. Um, it's cheaply made, but I did like it. Check, check it out if you can find it. This one I just got, the core, because, because, uh, the other DVD I had, something went wrong with it. I don't know, it wouldn't play in the player, I was like kicking at it, and eventually I just got fed up and bought a new one. I know, there's a lot to go through. Um, next one I got is That Old Feeling, with Bette Milder and Dennis Farina. Um, this is one where, uh, they, uh, they hate each other and all that crap, and they they got divorced and all that, and eventually they find love again between them. I liked it, I really did. Um, I thought it. I really liked the ending too. Next one I got is Mr. Destiny. Definitely check this one out um, with Jim Belushi. This is one where he if something happened like completely different in his life like or if he did one thing different this whole chain reaction of different things happen I loved it loved this film next one I got and you're probably thinking how did you get all these DVDs um they were actually pretty cheap you know um they were only about three dollars each or so some of them were ten just about a couple or so, but most of these were three dollars. I mean, come on, three dollars? I mean, people use that as toilet paper nowadays. Um, but, Mr. Baseball, um, this was good, not great. It was good. Um, he gets traded to this Japanese team, and it's, it's got some funny moments. Next one is Moving McAllister with John Hader, and I realize uh, Coulter got this years back in one of his updates um, but I did like this especially like the the part with the where he had to squeeze his pimple <laughs> he was just like I can't function right that was funny next one I got is Beethoven's Big Break I liked it um, I had this huge craving to get it as you can see this one was six ninety nine, so this one was a little bit more but I liked that one Next one I got is Hocus Pocus, absolute Walt Disney classic. This is when Walt Disney was good. This is when they could make, I mean, nowadays they're putting out stuff like Old Dogs, and they're not that great. But this is when they were good. So many. Next one, this one I got for Christmas, so I didn't, I didn't even have to pay for it. <laughs> Hotel for Dogs, I watched it in theaters and I loved it. But of course I have a thing for dogs. Not like a sexual thing or anything. I mean, no, but I just like them, you know, like how people love animals. I don't love it. I, I don't know. Next one, Snow Dogs. Um, this, I remember seeing this in theaters, and I just had a big craving to see it again. Gosh, I know, there's a lot. Next one, Space Jam with my, uh, Michael, I was going to say Michael Jackson. Michael Jordan. And I remember when I was little, I used to get Michael Jackson and Michael Jordan mixed up. And I was like, I was, also, I was always asking myself, how did Michael Jordan get white? I know I'm crazy, but this is a two-disc edition. I know jo Joe Dante didn't like this very much. That's why he made Looney Tunes back in action, but I liked it. Next one, this one you really need to check out. Campfire Tales. This is, if you like Creepshow or Tales from the Crypt or anything, check this out. Because that's basically what it is. Just an anthology type thing. This sucked. I always know what you did last summer. That sucked. I don't even want it. Um, next one, a double feature. I'll always, um, I still know what you did last summer. It was, I liked it. The CGI wasn't very good. But... I really like the um, I Know What You Did Last Summer. That was like a 90's classic. Next one, Stepmom. Really liked it. I love that one. Probably one of my favorite Chris Columbus films. Next one, I just wanted to see it. Jungle Fever. It was three dollars. I, I liked it. Spike Lee film. Next one, I really liked this one. Fear with Mark Wahlberg. 
This is one where Reese Witherspoon goes out with this guy and he goes crazy and he and she's he's just so protective of her. Check fear out. And I got two Blu-rays for Christmas. The Dark Knight. I like it. Yes, I do like it. I know a lot of people are dissing it lately because I guess they're they didn't like the all the hype about it. Next one, probably one of the best films I saw of 2009, Orphan on Blu-ray. That's all the time I have. I'm sorry, I didn't get to explain them. But there's my DVD update. Thanks for watching. You, you guys are awesome, and girls, whoever. Um, please subscribe and all that crap. Uh, I'll see you all later.